Hey everybody, Therese here from The Woodsy Couple. So, worst case scenario, you're paddling up river against a current with one paddle and you puncture a hole in your inflatable. Now what? On our last trip to Crooked River, we got to do just that. While Brian paddled vigorously back to shore, I plugged the hole with my thumb and hoped for the best. Once we got the board back to camp, I panicked. There goes my $300 investment down the drain. Once we realized the Dama repair kit doesn't come with glue or adhesive repair tape, only extra vinyl, I quickly grabbed the only glue I had, Gorilla Glue, and plopped down a piece of vinyl hoping it would stop the release of air. I was wrong. I deflated the board so I wouldn't have to hear the hiss of the leak. Once we got back home, I resolved to fix the hole by getting the proper tools like waterproof and flexible adhesive that's specially made for inflatables like myself. I grabbed some water and Dawn soap in the spray bottle, some alcohol, sandpaper, replacement vinyl, a rag, and some adhesive. I sanded down the vinyl I glued in place at camp and then prep the surface for the glue using soap and alcohol. I applied a few thin layers of adhesive and let them dry for five minutes according to the Dama repair kit instructions. Then I applied one final layer and applied a second layer of vinyl. I let that cure for 24 hours as per the instructions for the adhesive. Fast forward to the next day and it was time to inflate I was partially worried the board would explode in my face, but thankfully it inflated without problem. Inflation took about 15 minutes, which is normal. I sprayed an additional layer of soap on the patch to see if any bubbles would appear, but everything worked perfectly. I can't wait to take my Dama board out on the water soon. As always, thanks for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe.